All right, another week in the books, but this one is a few days late. I apologize about that, but I really didn't get the chance to train much at all last week. In fact, I only trained two days, which was on Sunday and Monday. Now, this was something I wasn't anticipating. I had an offsite for work outside of Boston, which for me is about, about an hour and a half away. So when you figure a round trip is a three hour drive each day, every day this week, it just really cut into my time where normally I would spend in the gym. Now, Plus, add to the fact that after the days in the office, I had some after work activities like dinners and things like that. I just didn't have enough time to go and train. And I missed training because number one, I wasn't able to get to the gym or my basement in this case because I was away. And I missed training too because I can't tell you how much I've wanted to train so badly this week because I can't. And that's one of the things that is actually probably a good thing. Um, on this particular day you're watching on Sunday, I was just kind of working up to some heavy-ish work on deadlifts, just showing you some of the weights, uh, but not some of the other sets I did because who cares about volume work. Uh, but I ended up working up to do this top set of 240. My sumo sucks, it's gonna suck, it's gonna be something I'm going to work on. And then the second day just really worked on some box squatting and what I did is I adjusted the height of the box to be a little bit higher up, um, basically right before my glutes and my hams give out. And then as I get more comfortable doing this, I'll probably lower the box and take some of those mats off of the top. Um, but getting back to my main talk point is I have a tendency to kind of stray a little bit. So I knew I was doing this thing for work, so that's one of the reasons I haven't jumped back onto any specific programming just yet. I also uh, will be here for this week, but in the middle of next week, I'll be going to Arizona for a family vacation for about eight days, and I'm not planning on training. Uh, so again, I'm not really going to be jumping into any kind of programming or at least you know, some sort of structure until I get back from that trip, which will be in the middle of February. So that's another reason why I wanted to get that competition in, even though I might not have felt the most prepared. I just knew given the circumstances, I wouldn't have another opportunity to really train and figured I might as well test out while I'm somewhat peaked in that instance. Uh, but as I said, missing training, I'm really looking forward to getting back in the gym. I'm really looking forward to getting back into programming. And I know I have the tendency to talk somewhat negatively at times, but I really do love training. And when I can't do it, it really kind of drives me nuts because not only is it kind of like my little haven in my basement, but it's also an extremely good way to relieve stress and for me to clear my mind and not focus on some of the other things with work that are going on or other instances, you know, that might be getting in my head. Uh, so I'm looking forward to doing that, but that being said, you won't be seeing a lot of videos from me over the course of the next two weeks or so. I'll try to get up another review video if I can, but chances are it's not going to be until I get back from my trip. But that's okay because I got some really cool shit coming. If you want to know what kind of cool shit, follow me on Instagram because I have the tendency to post a lot of that kind of stuff on there. So in the meantime, as always, thanks for watching and stay big.